We all know slot machines are unpredictable, but have you ever stopped to wonder how unpredictable? I mean, especially online casinos. How are we ever supposed to know if they're actually playing fair? And how do they actually decide if you win or not? Well, I asked myself the same thing, and in the process of researching this topic, I found something pretty interesting about how most companies design their games. But in order to understand what I actually found, we first need to understand how regular slot machines work. See, normally, physical slot machines are constructed with a small computer chip inside of them. This chip rapidly cycles through millions of numbers randomly, each of them representing a specific outcome of a game. The millisecond the player taps the spin button, this cycling is stopped, and the results of the game are decided meaning that the wheels spinning and locking into place are only just for visual effect. The machine already knows if you've won or lost the second you've pressed the button. Online slot machines, however, have to work a little bit differently because we can't really have physical hardware inside of a game that someone can play on their browser. Nor is it efficient to have millions of chips generating numbers until someone decides to spin one of the games. Instead, online casinos use a different method of deciding whether or not these games are going to win or lose. In order to accomplish this, there is one key technology that the system relies on, and it's known as cryptographic hashing. Now, I'm going to avoid going into the technical jargon, because it's not super important to understand how it actually works in order to know what it does. But essentially, what we can do is by using a specific algorithm that computer scientists have made called SHA-256, we can enter any series of letters, numbers, or words we want, and by feeding it into this algorithm, we can generate a series of numbers 256 digits long called a hash. Although it was easy to get this hash from whatever it was that we put into the algorithm, it is essentially impossible, no matter how hard we try, to work out what the message was originally just by looking at the numbers generated by the algorithm. This essentially acts as a one-way lock. Generally, the way that this is used is by getting two halves of a message, half decided by the casino servers and the other half decided by the player. These can then be combined to form an original message that we can feed into the SHA-256 algorithm. This will give us a random hash. This couldn't have been known either by you or the casino right up until you decided to spin. Now, this 256 digit number that is given to us by the algorithm, of course, doesn't mean anything on its own. It's at this point that it's up to the game provider to decide how to interpret this number to get their final results. For whatever reason, some casinos don't seem to like posting their code on how they do this publicly. But I've done a bit of digging and I've managed to find out how it's done by one company and I imagine it's probably pretty similar to how the other casinos do it as well. Essentially, by picking and choosing certain bits of the number out of certain spots, we can reliably create a random number ranging from 0 to 1. Each of these numbers get used to decide one outcome, for example, one reel of a slot machine, or one card dealt in blackjack, etc. Depending on which game the user is playing, these results are multiplied by the number of possible different real configurations and rounded to the nearest number. So if there were a hundred possible different ways that the real could land, then it would be multiplied by a hundred and then rounded to the nearest whole number. In order for the players to truly trust such a system though, there should be some method of verifying these results independently. Most game providers don't allow you to actually verify the results of their game after each spin. However, B Gaming's method not only allows you to verify each outcome, but it also allows you to personally impact the outcome of each spin with a configurable client seed. Before any game is played, 12 possible results for each reel are already decided before the button is even pressed. This table of possible results is then placed into the SHA-256 algorithm and the results shown to us in the next game tab in the info section. This means the casino already knows what the results of the next spin is going to be. But because it has been locked with our one-way key, there's no way of us possibly knowing if this spin is going to be a win or not. After the spin, all of the information that was originally put into the SHA-256 algorithm is given to us in its full glory. From this, we can see the total table of results that were given, and we can see that for each of the chosen client seed numbers, we get the designated section in the original message. What's more, 
is that by copying and pasting this message into any SHA-256 algorithm, it will spit out the hash from that message. And we can then verify that they match up to the hash that was originally given to us in the beginning. This means no matter what our bet was, the results of this spin were always going to be the same. And that means the casino can't change the results of the game even if your bet is really big or really small. Now, unfortunately, only some game providers actually give this ability. Most don't even tell us how their RNG or scaling are done. These companies generally do have third-party verification, but that's usually it. After my research, I realized there are four different categories that these game providers can fall into. First off, we have completely trustworthy sites. These are the ones that have known RNG algorithms and can be verified by anyone at any time. Now, the only company I've actually managed to find that do this is Catchy Games, although their selection of games is very limited, having only one type of slot machine. Secondly, we have game companies that have either publicly known RNG algorithms or are independently verifiable by some method. I've managed to find two companies that fall into this category, those being Spribe and B Gaming. Lastly are games where the RNG algorithms are unknown and there's no method of verifying the results yourself and we have to completely rely on the judgment of external companies like iTech or BMM test labs. Some of these companies are NetGaming, Bellatra, IGT, Platypus and OneSpin 4Win. Now the important thing to note here is that there are hundreds of online slot machine providers and that these are only a few of the bigger ones and generally most casinos use a variety of different providers to ensure they have a wide array of game selections. In order to play the catchy games slot machine I've only found it available on BitStars Casino as they're the only ones I could find that are actually partnered with them. I have been using their website for a little while now and they've got pretty good bonuses like free spins on a Wednesday which I generally come back for every week. If you're looking to try it out I'll leave a link below otherwise pretty much every other casino will have a wide variety of games to offer. Another casino I've found 7-bit which I've been using recently also allows you to actually sort your games by which company makes them, letting you choose which one you'd like to play, which is pretty handy. So in short, there are only a few companies out there that are actually making slot machines that actually allow the player to prove the fairness of their results at any point. Most of them are completely reliant on external companies to verify their games and source code. I think it's highly unlikely that these providers are working with the casinos in order to rig the games to, in order to disadvantage the player. Um, so I wouldn't think that they're rigged. After all, when you think about it, slot machines are already designed to make money. Why would a million dollar company risk the entirety of their business in order to get just a slightly better edge and hope no one notices? I just don't think it's realistic. Anyway guys, I do want to thank you for watching this video all the way to the end. It really does mean a lot to me and it helps the algorithm push this knowledge out to more people. This is probably the hardest video I've ever made for this channel and I learned a lot about video editing and just overall production. So I hope you guys enjoyed and I really do hope that I can continue to bring you better and better content. So good luck out there guys, win big and take it easy. Cheers.